Alrighty guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, I'll be playing some Sotai Control today in Diamond Tier. Um, if you've been following my channel, I used to be in Mythic, but I haven't played for... I think since the last time I made Mythic was June. And that's the last time I really made an effort to make Mythic, but there you go. Um, if we don't make it, we don't make it. But if you watched my last video with Blue White Control, we ended up going 4-1. Uh, in uh, the diamond tier um, I will be attaching that video at the end of this one so if you want to watch that video uh, please feel free to do so today we're going to be playing so tight control um, it's a very very good list what I will say is sometimes you can get overrun by aggressive strategies so um, it can be a little bit weak to certain decks uh, in particular combo decks um, so We'll see how we do today. I think his main strengths are against like mid-range fat creature decks, if, if I'm honest. But like I said, we'll see how we do. Um, I like blue-white control because of cast out. Cast out makes blue-white control absolutely fantastic. Being able to target any non-land permanent is fantastic. And what we are relying on is being able to fort seas, being able to maelstrom pulse. At sorcery speed which obviously isn't as good uh, compared to cast out um, but so tight control is a pretty good deck and um, we're just gonna see how we do with so tight control really so uh, we got a cling to dust is pretty good deals with like graveyard shenanigans John sacrifice another opposing Uru, etc got free fatal push four fort C's free sensor Tails End to eliminate four growth spiral to help us ramp. Hydroid uh, Crassus or Crasis, whatever you want to call it. Uh, really good with um, the Nisa to help us generate a shit ton of mana. And we can cast this for like eight or ten sometimes, which is fantastic. We've got uh, two Narset Part of Veils, Cry of the Carnarium. I was getting overrun by little dorky creatures, so decided to bring in Cry of the Carnarium. We've got two Maelstrom Posts, three Ural Titan of Nature's Wrath, two Extinction Event. I was kind of debating whether or not to bring Languish in instead, but I've just got decided to go with the Exile with two Extinction Event. Let's see how it goes today. Three Nisa, one Ash Out Nightmare and Muse, and two Shark Typhoon. We've also got two Island, one Swamp, one Forest, three Drowned Catacomb, four Watty Grave, a Woodland Cemetery. Uh, a Zagoth Trium and four Fable Passage. What I might do actually, thinking about it, is I might just get another Zagoth, whatever the hell it's called, right now. Because they're really good lands and sometimes we can't get kind of mana screwed. Normally I like to play them turn one or in the late game they just, just draw a card which is good. Um, we are going to get rid of a forest. So yeah, so we've got what? 8, 9, 13, 17, 20. Only 23 land? Is that right? 8, 9, 13, 17, 20. 24 land. 24 land. Can't be right. Two, three, four, seven, eleven, fifteen, sixteen. Only twenty-four. Oh god! Well, actually, scrap that. We might need to bring in another land here. That's pretty bad. Um. Let's, oh god. What would we take out though? That's the problem. Let's take out one of the shark typhoons. 
I think land are obviously land are very very important here. So let's bring in the uh, let's get a woodland cemetery. And let's actually get that with one of the rares that we got. I didn't realise we were playing with so few lands. I mean, we need at least twenty-five really. One, two, three, six, ten, fourteen, sixteen, twenty. Am I missing something here? 3, 4, 7, 11, 15, 17, 21, yeah, 25 at least. Alright, this should be, this should run better now, hopefully. Jeez, okay. Okay, good. This is better. This is better. Can't believe I was only running, <laughs> I can't believe I was only running 20. 23, 24? Oh my god. Woo! Alright. That was, uh. No wonder. So there was some points in the matches. We, we've done pretty well with Sotai Control, but sometimes we did a little bit getting like mana screwed. Now I know why. So, um. Yeah. Anyway, let's click play then and um, let's go to Historic Ranked. I have been jamming with uh, Demir Control as well, but um, today we're just going to be playing Sotai Control. Let's see how we do, guys. We're playing against Happy. Playing against a creature deck, we might get overrun here. No green man either. We can cycle the senses. I'll keep. Playing against a land for deck bollocks thing, so we haven't got green mana, so just a queen. Alrighty. Things annoying. <clears throat> we have got green mana, but I want to keep up center here. It's actually paid for that as well, hasn't it? You must have something. Okay, sensor is going to be good for us. The push is good. Let's play this thing.
Well, that's worked out pretty well for us, I think. I'm actually going to shock myself here and have access to Sansa and Grove Spiral. I guess a questing beast or something. We might have collected company. Let's grow spiral. All right, this mammoth is something I didn't really want to see. Want to cling to dust on my sensor? I think we need to draw a bloody removal spell ASAP. Oh my god. Holy shit, we just drew nothing there. Oh, we can tails end it, thank god. That's good. So please find us something. Thank god for that. Do I shock myself here? I don't think we shock ourselves. I guess one route to it's dying. Okay, could have been worse. Could have been worse. Could hydro crisis for, for, for four here. I think I will gain a bit of life. to take the damage. And then block. I can't even cast that, can I? That's annoying. Eliminate's good.
Think we could shark typhoon here for one. I'm a little bit concerned about collected company. All right, fucking hell. Oh my god, and we got up to tier three. Jesus Christ. Oh. My heart is racing here. Okay, I guess. I'm actually going to play the Fable Passage first to get green mana so that we can potentially grow Spiral. He has Mulligans here. We struggle against Lurus decks, so it's going to be a tough matchup. We've got a single cling to dust. So, not good. Yeah, no, some pops are bad. Ship turn to them. So is a blue white aura deck or something? Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna go spiral here. Tapped. I think we will eliminate this thing because it's very, very good. Although we can Uro and eliminate here, so that seems pretty good actually. Another Uru. Let's get ourselves a Island. Might be a bit of a mistake not having to access to two forests with the Fable Passage. We're gonna cast this at some point. Alright, it's round, okay. Whenever you cast um, an aura or whatever, let's draw a card. I think we fire this off. We can't risk not drawing up. We need a forest. This is getting annoying now. These are just draw engines, aren't they? Oh, there's another one. Jesus Christ. I think we need we need that second um, forest if we can. So we're gonna cycle this. Oh god, oh, push it bad, push, well, double push, Jesus. Alright. Blimey. We're getting all the goods. Still need that double forest, which is kind of eluding us right now. Okay, sir. Uh, 
Oh god. Alright, Hydro Crassus for uh, five. Hopefully, we get the stupid. What was, what's that about? Oh, it's a four, isn't it? Oh my god, where's the fucking forest? Where's the forest? Come on! Come on! Oh, Jesus Christ. I guess to draw a card. I guess to draw what? Don't want him drawing cards, but I'm not gonna block for a minute. Or do I? No blocks. Christ. <sighs> we need another removal spell. We've already seen quite a few. What, two? Two push, one eliminate. My god, man. There it is! Okay. So I think we can do all of it now. Yes, we can. Okay, now finally. Vigilance and haste. Now we can do a roll. We need to find a removal spell. There it is. Bet he's got some sort of protection spell or something though. Oh shit. We dead? Oh god. What's he gonna go after here? My life total must hold me. Oh god. So remove a stupid counter off this. Alright, let's get rid of this finally. Um, let's do this in the forest. Let's swing. Put this onto the battlefield. Um, we may as well play the other Uru. And obviously, keep this one. You have to draw cards. Ash Yog Nightmare Muse is pretty good. Turn this so you can't enchant it. And we'll end the turn, I guess. <sighs> of course, Barry does. Here we go again. It's a free five. Let's remove a counter off this. Yep, yeah, he's seen enough. Blimey, Jesus Christ. We've had some difficult matchups here, guys. With tilt eye control. Jesus Christ. Whew. Ugh. 
So we played against Auras, we played against Gruul. We get to go first. I won't keep. Let's see what goes on here. Alright, nothing. So we're playing against. Oh dear, it looks like we're playing against some sort of. Ugin Dak or something. I don't know. That's Kling. That's your rule. I feel like this is like a race against time here. Jesus Christ. The five mana. You can actually up that though. Put him back a turn. The Excel. Oh, okay. Let's do the trio. Let's smash for six. Let's hyper cross us for two. Draw an extra card. So I gain some valuable life, which is annoying. Got a Forsaken Monument. Another Mind Stone. Fourth season now. What's he got? Holy shit. Right, let's get the rid of the Ulamog.
that's corn for two, I guess. Uh, sorry, hydro casters for two. Oh my god, Ugin. What the hell? He just drew an Ugin. We're dead. Oh, are we? Well, I don't know, actually. We go after the other life total. I feel like we need to get rid of this bloody Ugin. Or do we just go after their life total? And you'd only be down to seven. Oh, he just drew that fucking Ugin. Wrecked my fucking hopes and dreams. Actually, what am I doing here? Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should have just attacked them, actually. I can't even do that anyway, can I? Let's end the turn. Yeah, maybe I should. I don't know. Hugin's dangerous, so. Extinction event was a good draw. I'm not too sure I'm going to cling back from this. Extinction event was a beautiful draw from him. Yeah, let's concede. That Ugin was just too much. <clears throat> I think if it wasn't for that Ugin, I think we would have won that game. But it is what it is. Oh dear. This is terrible. 
Oh god. <laughs> oh god, this is much better. Wanna bolt the bird as they say? I really wanted to draw on tap land though. Semi for Wax Marble deck. Oh dear. Tune with the Aoife, oh my god. Tune with the again. Holy smokes. I'm gonna have to keep up a Lonely Tales end. That's pretty good against an E for Wax Marble, to be fair. So, chances he's got another one. <sighs> All right. One to the top, one to the bottom. So obviously sees what he likes, so likes what he sees. Man is a bit clunky here, isn't it? Lovely. Can we? Yeah, we can hear him.
Something's just done that! With a Norse on the battlefield! Oh! Oh! No. What the fuck? Oh! Oh my god! You have got to be kidding me! Oh! Oh my god! That is hilarious! That is funny, isn't it? Oh my god! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh god! Oh my word! I'm gonna finish it there, guys. I can't. I can't finish it any better than that. My god! I hope you enjoyed the matches. That was absolutely hilarious. Hey, something's going on in the store. Before we go. Daily deals. Oh, that's a lot of crap. All right, guys. Uh, the Yugi matchup was, in all fairness, I should have pushed the creature that the Yugi token only sent one of my free frees at Yugi and sent the other two at them. Obviously, that didn't matter because he drew he drew a, an extinction event, but that's what I should have done. Alright guys, hopefully I shall see you in future matches. Take care, God bless, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.